And more celebrations to show you in Jefferson Parish. WGNOZ Daniels took a break from the world of sports to hang out on the Metairie Parade route, and he has a close look from that sideline. After a year of being dormant, Mardi Gras was back in 2022. Argus the 37th, businessman Lee Giorgio, said he could sense from the large crowds that they were ready to put the recent past behind them. We've been cooped up for two years and we've had, uh, we can say to heck with the pandemic. Uh, Idaho, it's over with. So let's get back to enjoying Mardi Gras, community, families. Former Saints punter Thomas Morstead, a member of the 2009 Super Bowl champions, reigned as Grand Marshal. Last year at this time, he was cut by the Saints as a salary cap casualty. Weeks later, Argus made a special appeal to him to join them in 2022. It was a second line started marching down our street, stopped at our house and knocked on the door, needed to see me and uh, asked if I'd be the Grand Marshal for this year's August parade. So uh, it was, especially the timing of it was, was kind of cool for me. Um, seeing that I was just fresh, so it was good. The fans were rocking, just like they do in the fall at the Superdome. It is a place Morstead would love to kick again as the opposition, but not, he says, out of spite, just because it is great to be in New Orleans. I miss being here, you know, in the fall. I miss being here, I miss my teammates and miss the fans, but, um, you know, life happens and, you know, that's just what happened. And one of the best parts of life here was back. It was a colossal day to be at a parade in Metairie at Daniels, WGNO News.